Hey, how's it going? Good morning. Hey, Irish Nonsense and Paul. How's things? Hey, Kuro. It's funny, like I had dreads for like 14 years and the partition, it's like so, so ruined my, you see? <laughs> has forced the hair to be default partitioned, you see? Hey, Lurip, good morning, good morning. And Michal, all the all-stars, the all-star team has gathered. And Eastern, you are new. Good morning. Or good evening. I don't know where, where you are. All right. Throw me some topics and let's, uh, let's get the ball rolling. Or the dice rolling. Hey. <laughs> All stars. For sure. For sure. I need to change the nib of my my stylus soon. It's uh, getting a bit pointy. Master of Dice, Jungle Scout, Android, Bjorn the Knight, Atlantean Prince, Bjorn the Knight. <laughs> that is hilarious. One, two, three, four. I need two more. Two more. Two more topics. You can do it. All right, I'll I'll roll the dice, and if it's five or six, it's gonna be the next topic. Ah, oh, it was number four. So number four is uh, Atlantean Prince. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Congratulations, Irish nonsense. Uh, Atlantean. Prince by Irish nonsense. Congratulations! Yeah! Second topic. Fantastic, fantastic. All right. Let's get the ball rolling. Time is rolling. And uh, let's design. I feel like I want to design something. So. Like pose, let's have him like uh, let's have him walking with a. I think I should put a bird on him, just so like he's in tune with nature, right? That's pretty. Uh, uh, yeah, mm. it's in a decent pose. Man, I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to going on vacation, of not having the stress of juggling. Like I'll do my warm ups, obviously. Um, let's have him. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be really good, really nice not to have uh, some pressure to perform at work. <laughs> the air part, it really bugs you, doesn't it? I will go and I will go and buy a proper dice, right? Don't you worry. Next year will be uh, it'll be a uh, thirty minute uh, overhaul.
you'll you'll have your redemption. Actually, is that hot? I don't want there. I want the hand to be up there. <laughs> it's okay. I'll 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 make a new dice. I'll buy a new dice. I'll just pop into the dice store. <laughs> Whatever that is, right? Okay, let's uh, I'm going to try try something. Um, I want to experiment with um, um, a technique. Now I don't know how well it's going to end up looking, but um, hopefully. Uh, Gonna be decent. Um, Irish nonsense. I don't know. I think uh, I think would be cool with an on-screen dice as well. Child labor. Yeah, but uh, in all honesty, my son might not even remember that he made the dice for for the for the occasion. So we'll see. I can ask him that this dear bird guy really hates his dice. <laughs> mm hmm. There we go. You're such a such a rude person, dear part. <laughs> no, just kidding. It's all good. I already have plans to change it. It's it's a too wonky. They're bored. No, I'm just kidding. Don't worry. Um, well, um, I think I'll. Um, I, I want to investigate if there's any like um, on-screen dice. I mean, I could even just have it floating. It doesn't need to be OBS, right? It, because I think um, I've set up OBS to capture the screen and not the program. So maybe I could just have an on-screen on program, like the rolls of dice. Maybe there's even like some web page, uh, whatever, you know. I think that'll, I think that'll be cool. So, um, yeah, my plans for... Um, for my holidays is to um, work on an uh, intro outro for a 30 minute warm up so it's a little bit more um, coherent uh, so I also don't need to click as much uh, I know that you could um, like set up different things so that one goes after the other um, so I, I'm gonna have to research that but uh, um, 
but yeah, it it I think it'll be easy to do. I hope. Uh, my goal is to have like a intro outro set up um, so that uh, they kind of just somehow play when I click. Hey, good morning, Gak6, Captain Jetlag. <laughs> Larivia. No, it's all good. Don't you worry. Don't you worry, dear part. I was just having some fun. Yeah, the elevator music. Uh, I love that elevator music. I want to put it in the in the intro. Uh, Gaxix, I do a lot of uh, fashion stuff actually. Um, I do a lot of research about it as well. Now I'm not claiming to be like any any major like fashion guy in that sense, but. Uh, I do know a little bit of of stuff like that. Over the years, I've enjoyed um, me and another guy. We uh, set up um, accounts at um, fashion blog uh, forums, you know, for fashion students, and we kind of bounced ideas of them. This was uh, many years ago. So I doubt uh, there's maybe stuff, places like that anymore. But uh, it was very interesting to hear uh, like uh, fashion people's uh, feedback. So in that re in that way, uh, I learned some some things about it. Kuru, what do I think about Anthony Jones' art? I mean, he's good. He's a skilled artist. Nothing more to say about it. I mean, he's done good, good designs. Um, that's about it. It's pretty good. I like it. I think he he did a lot of work for Gears of uh, God of War, right? A lot of creature designs and stuff. I think um, we design quite similarly. Uh, we definitely sit in the same category of of, of uh, designs, I would say. But obviously, uh, separately, we we have our own each each flavor. But uh, yeah, I, I like his stuff. I think it's good.
Uh, Rich Johnson's. That's cool. Lou Rib, yeah. I started it quite late as well. Where am I with time? Halfway mark approximately. Hello, Mila. Good morning. Yeah, so like I said earlier, I, I want to do, um, I want to fix a lot of uh, stuff for um, the 30 minute warm up thing over the Christmas holiday. I want to, um, like, uh, oh wait. Uh, I want to set time aside for it. Um, so that uh, so that it, so that it will be done. I think it's uh, it's very much needed. Some proper outro. <laughs> Irish nonsense, yeah. You're traveling, actually. That, that's pretty cool. It's really nice to to hear that you're like on. I guess you're on your phone, right? That's pretty cool. I love technology that way. That that this is possible. Even what would be cooler is that uh, like you're actually uh, like uh, with a. Obviously, you're hearing me, which means you're on a headset, I guess. Which is even 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 cooler Uh, I, I really focus, so I just, I'm stop, stopping talking, which isn't good. Um, yeah, so I want to make, I think, um, I have no idea how to make the outro for my 30-minute <laughs> stream. Uh, I don't want to be, like, cheesy about it and, and just have myself, like, being and doing a silly song. I don't think people <laughs> would appreciate that. Um, probably just some sort of uh, I, I had the idea of um, the intro and outro 
uh, being um, uh, no, I want to keep it as a surprise. I want to keep it as a surprise, uh, so that when I do my first streaming next year, it's going to be like an overhaul. I want to have uh, new graphics for, uh, like, for the stream here as well. Hey, good morning, Tormund. Tormund, yeah, <laughs> maybe. Maybe maybe that's the solution. Just make you do it. Like community driven cheesy song. But it was really cool, um, Irish nonsense, that you're uh, you're uh, have a fashion degree, uh, maybe not degree, but studied fashion. Uh, that's really cool. That's really really cool. I think it's. Um, I'm, I'm definitely sure that it helps a lot understanding like what's uh, required was it a part of your course or was it just like something that you uh, that you took up I think it's uh, the key of, of um, like for for the future, like you're future proofing yourself by uh, by educating yourself through internet. Because internet, you can find information on almost everything, and it's uh, down to you what you do with it. Like I mean, there is free um, there's free uh, classes even to take from uh, MIT and so on over over the internet I mean and people if you if you you don't like take that in opportunity uh, like to to just further yourself right then there you have no right uh, I'm not saying that anyone is but I mean some people are complaining about like uh, n like nothing is happening like my education is is bad uh, like for me it's always like but change it <laughs> you know it's the simplest thing to do just change it there's tons of stuff to learn it's just your own limitations that kind of set you back That's really cool, Irish run nonsense. Gaxix, yeah, that it, it is extremely hard to have the narrative there. That's cool, Irish nonsense. That's really awesome. Awesome. Okay, let's try. Let's try uh, this. This was my my plan for today to experiment with. Okay, that's a little bit too dark. So I, what what I wanted to play with was um, doing different kind of shading uh, to get the good base down and. Granted, this technique is not anything new. I've used it a lot of times. Um, 
and people at the, my studio used it a lot of times and so on, but uh, not for doing my warm-ups with. So I thought uh, I thought it would be cool to see how it works in a at a higher pace and what results you can get. Uh, Either way, congratulations, Irish nonsense. And uh, so you're um, you are uh, internshipping. Is that, is that, <laughs> you're in an internship. That's probably the more correct way to say it. I would say dr comics and, and uh, storyboards is completely different, uh, but it, they can also be similar. Storyboard can be stick figures, uh, comic can't. Like I think the biggest difference is like comics need to have the, the whole package, where uh, storyboarding, uh, you don't really have that requirement. You can like do rougher storyboards than you can do comics. That's great, uh, Irish nonsense. Um, where, if you don't mind me asking? You don't need to say like specific uh, company, but uh, like with what, um, if you don't mind. I think that will be interesting to know. Like what journey you are on. <laughs> Captain Jetlag, I think in storyboarding you have to include a lot more like uh, camera work and so on. I don't think it's uh, that straightforward. Um, so that you can like uh, get away with it like uh, you do in storyboards for comics. Like In storyboards you have to have like uh, information about panning, like where's the camera's gonna go um, and comics need to visually show that in series of frames rather than like a note on the on the storyboard. I think that's the a big difference. But uh, that's that's my point of view. Gaxix probably have another one.
I, I paged through, I paged through that one, uh, Michal. It looked pretty good. It looked um, nice and advanced. Yeah, like uh, exactly cool. The composition stuff was really interesting. How um, they take it from abstraction to something uh, like uh, realized, and the things to think about. And you could see, you could uh, analyze a lot of of the result versus the thumbnail. At least of what I page through. Hey, Kuiba. Good morning. You're joining in on the last two minutes of the stream. Oh, no. That's too bad. <clears throat> oh, three forty two in the morning. Wow, that's really hardcore of you. Thank you for joining, even though it's just going to be for a minute. Um, we can probably. Uh, go to bed with good conscience and at least you got a little bit of 30 minute warm up which is like a 30 minute good night uh, <laughs> from my end rather I'm gonna lull you to sleep I think uh, I think my time's up. It was a fun, fun little experiment of of uh, seeing um, how this technique worked. Uh, um, sketching it went. I th I'd say it went well, even though maybe not exactly like I wanted, but. Um, Yeah, it was um, a good experimentation. I think I'll I'll, I'll uh, play around with that uh, more. Yes. Let's give this bird some weird eyes, and then I'm going to call it call it a day. Hey, Georg. <laughs> Goodbye, Georg. Uh, thanks, Georg, for waking up and letting us know that you're alive. <laughs> uh, 
Thanks, dear Borg. Uh, thanks, Michal. Hey, Ben. Uh, thanks for joining. Unfortunately, the stream ends now, so... Uh, <laughs> thanks, Michal. I'm gonna... I tried to make him a, a little bit, like, royal. Um, but anyways, have a great day. That's the... That's the I'm uh, going that way. Uh, good night, everyone that's going to bed. Good morning, everyone that's gonna try to get some stuff done. Uh, I have to go deal with this, maybe. This madness, this bird's nest. Um, anyways, have a good one, everyone. Thanks you all for coming. Uh, thanks, uh, Irish Nonsense, for the topic. It was a good one. Uh, oh, a laser brush. Oh, too late. Um, Alright. Bye, all.